What's up everyone? Kobanrani456 here today, continuing my playthrough on Super Mario 3D Land for the Nintendo 3DS. So, last time we did World 3 and completed that 100% and got all star coins, and now we are going to continue on and go on to World 4. So, if you all are excited about this and want to keep on seeing more of this playthrough uploaded regularly, make sure to go ahead and smash that like button. Let's see if we can hit the like goal of 2000 likes for this video, and I'll make sure to upload the next part as soon as I can. But anyway, without any further ado, let's go ahead and get into World 4. Hey, my man Mario, getting that nice love letter from Princess Peach. I see you, Doc. Too bad, though, you're about to get friend-zoned, like always. But anyway, we're going to go on to World 4-1. And, uh, yeah, for question of the day, let me know in the comments below. What were your thoughts on the Hyrule Warriors Nintendo Direct that just um, happened last night? As uh, there was a lot of hype going on for it, we thought we were going to get um, quite a few big announcements. And uh, we also got a few uh, confirmations about uh, some characters actually being playable, which is uh, pretty awesome. Like, we can play all of the bad guys, like uh, we can play Gearham, we can play Xant, we can play all those characters. Which is really, really cool in my opinion. But uh, the biggest disappointment for me was that uh, it turns out the game is not going to have an online mode at all, like everyone thought it was. I was really hoping it would, because I thought it would have been really, really awesome, but I guess that is not the case at all, sadly, and uh, I don't know exactly how I feel like about the game like I used to. You know, I was really, really excited for it, because um, you know Nintendo at E3 was talking about how the game was going to have online co-op, I'm just like, oh my god. Like, when we talked to representatives and whatnot, they were like, yeah, the game's going to have online co-op like the Dynasty Warriors games, and, uh, you know, you're going to be able to play with other people online. But then, uh, just a few days ago, there was um, confirmation that there was not going to be story mode online, so I was hoping there would probably be, like, a PvP mode or something really cool like that. But nothing at all. Turns out, we only get just confirmation that there is local co-op, and the local co-op is going to be running at a lower resolution because of it running on the gamepad for the second player. So it's not split screen, it's for the second player on the, uh... It's for the um, second player on the uh, gamepad, so that really, really does suck. Not only do we get local co-op only, it's we get like a nerf to local co-op, which really does suck. But, uh, you know, I'm still excited for the game. I was really, really hyped about uh, Ganondorf's announcement because we got to see his new character design. And boy, does that man look powerful! He looks like he's freaking Super Saiyan, like, Gogeta or something like that. Like, he's just about to wreck everyone's soul. Like, he looks really, really awesome. Actually, you know what I'm gonna do here? Okay, I'm gonna get these star coins and screw you, Chain Chomp, because, you know, you just suck the biggest of... Oh, god dang it. Okay, that was close. Man, I could have kept my Tanuki suit and I would have been all good in everything. Like, the Tanuki suit is all powerful, man. It is all powerful. Alright, screw you guys. And look at this, just giving us coins. I don't want no stinking coins. I want to get a freaking... See, look at this clock. I want my Tanuki suit back. Like, the Tanuki suit is just too good. Like, I want it back. But sadly, we cannot get it back. But hey, at least we got a Fire Flower, so we will be able to burn everything here. Because we are a Pyromaniac! Yeah, it's been a while since I said something like that. <laughs> he said that all the time in my playthroughs. But, um, yeah, overall, I'm really excited for Hy Hyrule Warriors still. I'm going to actually be covering some of uh, the Japanese game on my channel. But, uh... Very disappointed that there is no online mode, because I thought that was going to greatly increase the replay value as hack and slash games, I don't know. They're just not the most, uh, they're not the most, um, engaging games you can play. Like, they kind of get old after, like, an hour or so. So, you know, then you just kind of put it down, and then you just pick it up later when you feel in the mood to play some more. But yeah, let me know in the comments below what you all thought about the, uh, you know, conference. Did you think it was good? Uh, did you wish for uh, some other characters to be confirmed? I know someone, uh, one of my friends, was hoping that Skull Kid would get confirmed. And when he saw what the moon does in the game, he was really, really disappointed about that. So that was kind of a bummer as well. But hey, look at that. Nice. Got that star coin. 
And uh, I think that one, uh, like, retro mode is actually pretty cool, to where you're basically, um, it's, it's almost like chess or something like that. I thought that was pretty cool. So, I don't know. I just feel that Nintendo drops the ball so many times on their games because, you know, they have so many opportunities to add online to their video games, but they choose not to because they're, they're stuck in this, like, gutter to where they think that everyone plays video games only locally. Like, they don't think people play video... Well, they do think that people play video games online, but it's like... You know, they don't realize that not everyone can play with people locally, and it's just like, God dang it, Nintendo, come on, like, step it up, man. It's not gonna hurt to add online. I know you may be like, well, we like local co-op more. Okay, that's perfectly fine. Give us local co-op. Not only that, though, give us, you know, the option to play online. Like, you know, that's such... Like, it's, it's getting really tiring, honestly, that Nintendo doesn't realize that they should just go ahead and get on this, you know, because people people play online. That's one thing a lot of people do. So they need to realize that and, you know, start implementing that into more of their games. But I don't know if they're ever going to learn at all. <laughs> I really don't know. All right, so we're going to get back up here. Uh... There's this area so that we can get to that star coin, because that's the second star coin. And definitely don't want to skip that, so... Alright, here we go, get up here. Uh, screw you, dude. I believe you can actually even blow away that ink right there. I'm not sure exactly, but I could be wrong. Oh, God. I missed my jump there a little bit. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Alright, I'm gonna actually see if I can, uh, oh, dang it. Alright, go through here. There we go! That's where it is! Alright, I knew it was somewhere around there. Alright. Oh, god dang. I, like, completely jumped off the stage right there. Alright, get back up here. But yeah, like, Super Mario 3D World. That would have been a great game to have online in. Like, I, I feel like it should have had online, because, you know, it was a fun game. It was a really fun multiplayer game. You know, so many people could have been able to play, and, you know, with how they did the camera and whatnot, I think it could have worked online as well, you know, not make people go too far off screen or whatever. And, uh, you know, some people were like, well, you know, it probably wouldn't work, because what if you were playing with someone and, you know, they weren't trying to cooperate with you? Well, you know, try and get your friends to play with you. Like, that's what you want to do mostly whenever you play games like that. You want to play with your friends. So it makes sense, you know, to play with your friends and try and cooperate. Or if they're trying to troll, then, you know, just, like, disconnect or whatever and don't play with that person. I mean, it's as simple as that. You can troll people, you know, locally, too. It's not a big deal. I don't know. People are just, eh. Nintendo's just behind in terms of online, at least in my opinion. But anyway, jump there, get the top of the flagpole, and we are done with 4-2. Speaking of 3... You know what? Actually, I'm going to save that as a topic for the next episode. I was going to actually talk about 3D World, but I think I'll save it for, like, question of the day for the next episode, because, uh... Yeah, I actually do like Super Mario 3D World a lot, but I think Super Mario 3D Land does a few things better than 3D World. I know that probably sounds crazy to some people, but uh, I'll talk about that later. <laughs> I don't know, I like to kind of keep my questions of the days and whatnot spread out so we can have uh, more interaction in the comments below and focus on different topics for each and every video. But anyway, we're going to go on to this stage, World 4-3. Get ourselves that nice and powerful 69 lives. All right, now you gotta be careful around here because sometimes, like, if you don't have 3D on, these platforms can be really, really deceptive, so you don't know whether or not you're gonna slide off or not. And uh, I've had this happen many, many times to me, so don't fall for it. Okay, here we go. The... Dang it! Ah, oh my god, what the heck? Are you kidding me? There we go, kill him. All right, so yeah, that's some weird block that has, like, a life in it or something like that or like it's like living I don't know it's so weird but um basically it tries to stump on you and if it stumps on you uh it basically um you know hurts you so be careful about that all right anyway go ahead and jump up here all right be careful all right and bounce all the way up to the sky all right here we go get that star let's go skadoosh and yeah, I'm not gonna sing because someone was like, oh, <laughs> I don't know, I just found it kind of funny how some people were like, oh my god, stop singing with the song and whatnot. But, um, 
Oh, I guess I can actually talk about the last question of the day. Seemed like a lot of people were actually excited about Super Mario Galaxy and all that stuff, so I'm gonna try and prepare that, you know, as an upcoming playthrough on my channel. Um, like I've said, you know, I want to cover another game as well that uh, I have, n that's like, you know, outside of Mario and Sonic and all that stuff. So I'm gonna probably do an update video very, very soon asking you all uh, what you all think I should do. Besides that, um, I've been thinking about Uncharted, uh, maybe Knight's Journey of Dreams, or maybe Chibi Robo, one of those games, something like that. So, you know, uh, be prepared for that soon. But uh, Mario Galaxy is going to be uh, the next uh, Mario playthrough, I guess, on my channel. And then after that, um, you know, Mario Galaxy 2, since a lot of people liked that idea as well. And then, um, I've been thinking, uh, for my next Sonic playthrough, I'll probably do something like maybe, uh, the Sonic Heroes, uh, Super Hard Modes playthrough. Because I think that'd be pretty fun to do. A lot of people have been asking about that, when that is going up. And, uh, you know, I think it'll be pretty fun. Super Hard Mode. <laughs> but alright, there we go. So that was 4-3, I believe. And now we're gonna go on to one of the... Oh god. You know, this stage isn't that bad, I'm gonna say that right now. But I just hate Boo Houses in general. Boo Houses are my least favorite stages, like in Mario games. Along with Ice Worlds and all that stuff. But Ice Worlds and all that stuff are just in general for any game. I just really don't like ice or desert stages at all. But for Mario games, I hate Boo Houses, man! They're just so annoying. I don't know. I, I, I really don't like them at all. Anyway, get that nice one-up. We've gotten ourselves 73 lives so far and have not died once. That is pretty impressive in my opinion. So let's try and uh, keep this going. Let's try and make sure we don't die or anything like that. Okay, swipe those people away. Swipe or no swiping. Wow. No, keep your, keep your bodies to yourself. All right. All right, go ahead and hit that right there. All right, where do we go here? All right. You gotta always be on your toes around here because you never know what's gonna happen. Alright, so there are different platforms around here to where you can, I believe, get a star coin right here if you swipe that. See right there? Look at that. If you if you break that thing, it makes <laughs> it makes like a, it makes the pipe show up, which is kind of funny. Anyway, if you have 3D on right here, it's really easy to see how this looks. Uh, if you have it off, it looks like you know you're just yeah, like you can jump right there. But nope, it's just an illusion. Gotta love the illusions there. Like that's what I really do like. Um, about, uh, what is it, this game, how they just really know how to take advantage of 3D. Alright, here we go, let's go, skadoosh! Alright, kill all you guys, kill all you guys, kill all you guys! Oh, yes, 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 yes. Alright, here we go. Okay, kill that dude one last time, there we go, nice, nice, nice. Alright, now third star coin, I believe, is after this area. Yeah, there it is, right there, okay, perfect. Alright, just hop right here. Okay, now this one is really, really tricky because what they try to do is fool you into thinking that there is no platform right there. So until you're actually pretty much on top of it, it's not going to show up at all, which is really, really annoying. Uh, okay, where the heck are we? There we go. Alright, there we go. There we go. Okay, right here. Alright, oh my god! That almost killed me right there. I hate that part. I always forget about that. All right, here we go. Let's go through here. Get that nice and powerful star power. And uh, we're right. Let's see here. All right. There we go. Top of the flagpole. 4-4 Four has been completed. But I, I was playing uh, Super Mario World <laughs> on Twitch. I don't know if uh, anyone would... If, if you were there watching me play Super Mario World on Twitch, let me know in the comments below. Because I was trying to go through the ghost house and it was just the most painful <laughs> experience ever. I hate those stages. And uh, they were extremely difficult in the 2D Mario games. Absolutely loathed them. But uh, now it's time to go to 4-5. Yeah, I want to stream more on Twitch. Twitch is a really, really awesome place to kind of just interact with viewers and whatnot, and, you know, it's kind of nice to play older games on there that, uh, you know, I don't normally cover on my main channel, like here. So, you know, if you all want to see older playthroughs of games and whatnot, make sure to follow me on Twitch, because I'm going to be doing uh, Fan Game Fridays. All of my Fan Game Fridays playthroughs are going to be on that channel, or on my Twitch channel, I should say. And uh, not only that, um... 
But this time I'm going to be doing other games. Like, I'm going to be doing online games. I'll probably do, like, Project M on YouTube and Twitch at the same time or something like that. But, uh, yeah, I'm definitely going to be doing, uh... I'm definitely going to be doing uh, both, uh, you know, I'm going to definitely be doing a lot more Twitch on my channel now. Okay, let's go ahead and get that star coin. Now, I'm curious to see what this is all about right here. So, let's see what this is. Okay, uh, alright. Oh, okay, this is it. Okay, so we just kind of hop around here and get uh, blocks hit right here. It's really weird. Alright. <laughs> Didn't really serve that much of a purpose at all, nor was it that's beneficial. I mean, we are one coin away from getting a one-up, I believe, but that is about it. Anyway, there we go. But yeah, I'm just trying to make sure that, uh, you know, I can provide you all as much content as possible and keep myself busy, you know, because I do YouTube pretty much full-time now. This is kind of like, you know, even though it's fun, like, it's still, I guess you could say, considered my job since I do earn, you know, from doing YouTube. But, you know, it's a fun job, I guess you could say, so I really do enjoy it. But I want to make sure, you know, I, like, keep busy, you know, I stay uh, consistent with my content. And, uh, you know, if you all like that and want to keep on seeing more, then uh, I'll try and keep on posting as much as I possibly can. Oh, God. I was close right there. Alright, so there is a star coin right there. Alright, that's the second one. Alright, third one. I have no idea where that one is. Uh, screw you, dudes. Get out of here, freaking boomerang bros. Alright, so I believe the third one is up here, if I'm correct. Man, 3D helps so much around here, though. Like, I, I love 3D in this game. Like, it's so great. Alright, I was just kind of fooling around with it right there <laughs> to kind of see which one I liked a little bit more there, but yeah, I think I like the uh, standard 3D that this game has. Uh, we don't need the time or anything like that because we are the Skadooshinator. We already go fast. Gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. Gotta go faster, 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 faster. Yep, damn. Running at speed of sound, they try quickest hedgehog around. Got ourselves a situation, stuck in a new location without any explanation. I don't know the rest of the lyrics. Mm -mm 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 don't, don't, don't wait, don't wait. Just go, 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 go. That's probably one of my least favorite animes. <laughs> Even though I love Sonic, I was not terribly fond of Sonic X. Uh, Sonic X, you know, the first season was good, second season was alright, third season was complete booty! I hated the third season. Like, the freaking Metarex, uh, arc, just no. Just no. I did not like the Metarex arc at all. Alright, uh, be careful here because we are running out of time here when it comes to getting the star coin, so... Alright, I'm gonna just flutter over here and kind of save some time. Yes! I'm loving all these Tanuki leaves, man. Like, they're just kind of just giving them to us, which is awesome because I love Tanuki leaves. Alright, so anyway, get the second star coin right there. These stages are really short, though, man. Do like, you see how short this is? Like, god dang. Alright, so now be careful here because that dude's carrying a bomb! Oh my god. Freaking like Princess Peach and Smash Bros or whatever. You can just randomly pull out a bomb. Oh my god. And of course I let that hit me right there. Alright, here we go. There we go. Third star coin acquired. Whew! That was close. I, I really did think I was gonna die right there. I was really, really scared. But hey, let's see if uh, we can get ourselves a Tanuki Leaf or something. But nope! Get ourselves a 1-Up, because, you know, we totally need more of those. <laughs> but hey, I ain't complaining. We've got ourselves 79 lives. We haven't died once. And uh, we've been doing pretty well this playthrough, I'm not going to lie. I'm, I'm very proud of myself. But then again, maybe I shouldn't be since this game is quite easy in many areas. Alright. What the... How the heck did I not land on her head? That's what I really don't understand right now. Okay, so she's just gonna kind of do a UFO attack on you. And, uh, yeah, it's really easy to avoid. Alright, here we go. Hmm. Alright, second hit on her, down. Alright, just one more and we should be good to go. You're too slow! Ah, now I'll show you, oh my god. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah, that's right. Eat my tea bags. Oh. 
I don't even know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm just acting so stupid right now. Jesus Christ. All right. Now we have to get the top of the flagpole here. If we did not get the top of the flagpole here, in fact, I'm gonna shut up right now so that I don't jinx myself because I tend to do that a lot. You know, just, just screw, screw. All right. All right. I'm gonna get on top of you. I'm gonna get on top of that nice big ball, giggity. Yeah, I see right here. Whoa! Ah, yes! <laughs> top of the flagpole, 80 lives. Let's go! I believe I can fly, yeah. And there we go, that is it for World 4. Very short episode, but uh, you know, that's how it is so far with all these worlds. You know, they're not too long at all. But anyway, if you all did enjoy this video and want to keep on seeing more, no, don't tell me to take a break, dang it. If you all want to keep on seeing more of this playthrough uploaded regularly, make sure to go and smash that like button. Let's see if we can hit the like goal of 2,000 likes for this video. I'll make sure to upload the next part as soon as I can. And then, as always, uh, you know, thank you all again for watching. See you all. Have a good day. Peace, Cobonermites.